like a wobble wobble shaky shaky heel i don't like that i need it to be sturdy i need it to be sure i need to be able to walk and know that my heel is not gonna crumble like that And today I'm going to share with you guys some items that I picked up from Shein. So if you're interested, let's get into the haul. So the first thing that I was so, so excited to get were these leggings, y'all. Like, look at this fringe. It's right up my alley. But they are too big. I got a 2X and these are like really, really, really big, okay? Especially in this, in this area. So I'm definitely going to try to exchange them for a 1X, but they do have a lot of stretch if y'all plan on picking these up. Um, also, a con is that they are pretty thin. They're some thin tights. They're cute, but they're thin. So you definitely need to put something underneath. But I love these. I also picked up this shirt. I just put this on, you know, just for the look. Um, I'll untuck it so y'all can see how far it comes down. It's just a regular shirt. And it does have this little off the shoulder-ish detailing here love this especially for my babies like me who need to wear a full-on bra this does cover i have on just a regular bra and i have it just tucked right here and this is really cute so yeah love these items but i'll definitely be getting these in a 1x if it's not sold out hopefully it's not because i need it i also got that same off the shoulder shirts in orange just want to show you guys and i believe they also had it in maroon but i did the orange and the black because i don't have any orange but i thought it would be cute against this melanin skin so pick that up every time you walk it sounds like shh, 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 shh. that's what this does that is annoying <laughs> so that ain't gonna work for me like i don't even want a smaller size because i just can't take all right y'all next up is this unfortunate <laughs> situation so um i don't have a mirror in front of me so i hope it's looking decent but this set, set um, is another one that i was excited to get i had you know an idea in mind of it being a cute little fitted situation i thought the top would be kind of cropped but it is not and i actually have it tucked in the back to show y'all kind of what i had envisioned but this is what I got. <laughs> so um, again, I went based off of the size and chart, but this top is definitely too big and the skirt just doesn't fit the way that I wanted it to. I'm not sure if it's the material or if I just need to size down or what. But I did want to show you guys because again, it may work for some of y'all out there. I think it's a really cute concept. It's just not working for me. So do with it as you will. <laughs> I honestly do remember ordering this dress, but I'm not mad at it. It's pretty cute. I can envision this with some cute little booties or a leather, faux leather jacket. I love the color. This is definitely perfect for fall, and I'm sure this is what attracted me to it. Excuse my bra. We're just trying on today, just raw. Um, but yeah, I thought this was really cute. I believe I got it in a 1X. It fits really good. Um, it is a ribbed material, but it is kind of thick. This one's not see-through because a lot of their stuff that I get this real bit see-through but this one is not so that's a good thing love this what y'all think all right next up I got these two items I would not wear these together just showing you guys together first let's talk about this faux velvet skirt this is number one really really soft it does have a good amount of stretch to it and it comes up under the bust so it is a bit high waist you can pull it down if you want to wear it longer. And I love the split on the side. This reminded me of the holidays. When I got this, I thought about possibly wearing it when my daughter and I take our holiday pictures. Um, so that was my reason for getting it. It was like $10. So I was like, maybe we'll try it and see. Um, but yeah, I like this skirt. Reminds me of the holidays. And this cute shirt, I just picked it up because I thought it was cute. It's my style. I love a wrapped shirt. I love the sleeves and I love this little peplum situation here. So this style of shirt is just right up my alley and I thought it'd be cute to add to my wardrobe. So yeah, I got these two items here. All right, you guys, these are the next two items. Again, I wouldn't wear this together. Just showing you guys. Um, number one, this button down top I thought was really cute. I don't have anything like it. Um, I love the colors. It reminds me of fall. And I don't know if you can see, but it has some gold um, little detailing in the shirt that I absolutely love. It's more like a rose gold or like a, um, more of an orangey toned gold. I don't know, but it just really interests me and I don't have anything like it. So I'm glad that I picked this up. It is sheer. And yeah, I really like this shirt. Now this skirt, it is different for me. I just want to try it out, but it's a no. Um, number one, it is a bit big. 
And then um, again, I got this according to the size chart, but it is big. But I also wanted to make sure that it wouldn't be too tight since it does have buttons and I do have hips. I didn't want it to have, you know, that tension area there, especially because you're sitting down and stuff like that. So you don't want it to be too big. But um, it just, in my opinion, it does not look good on me. Again, I don't have a mirror in front of me, but when I tried it on, I was just like, eh, it's a no for me. But again, I wanted to share with you guys because when I saw the ladies in the, um, you know, the people that leave reviews and they had it on, I thought it looked good on them, but it just don't look good on me. So it is what it is, but I wanted to share this with you guys in case you're interested, you may like it. It's a no for me. <laughs> All right, so this is definitely one of my favorite pieces, and it's just this plain chocolate bodysuit. I love the color. Um, it is ribbed, but it is a little bit of a thicker material. It's very soft. Um, and yeah, just a plain, cute bodysuit, but I love the color. I love the little cut right here. Um, yeah, this is cute to pair with some joggers for loungewear, put some jeans on, some cute little shoes to go somewhere. I just love this. And like I said, this little simple bodysuit is one of my favorite pieces out of this haul, so yeah love this i picked up this cute little i'm gonna call it a sweater because of the material but this is really really thin so um yeah and also this material is very itchy i don't know what material it is i really need to do better with reading shein's descriptions because y'all i'm not gonna lie i just see cute stuff and i put it in the cart especially because i do a lot of my shopping late at night and i don't have time to read but i need to do better but yeah this um it's really cute but it is very thin and this material is a little itchy so yeah but it is cute so do with it as you will <laughs> but yeah i'll probably be sending this one back just because the material is itchy i don't mind it being thin this would be cute you know to lounge around the house or you know you could throw it on with something put on a jacket and all of that but um i just don't like the way this material feels against my skin so i'll probably be sending this one back but it is cute let me know what y'all think all right next up i picked up this cute little waterfall jacket this is very cute and lightweight just thought it was nice to throw over something for the fall it does come with this tie waist detail this one doesn't have any like belt loops or anything so it'll be good to add if you want to add your own belt to it i typically like to add my own belt to these i don't normally wear the ones that come with it just depending on the style but um yeah i thought this was really cute just very lightweight something to throw on and add a little something to a plain dress or just jeans and a t-shirt like this yeah really cute now, if you saw my fall jackets haul, you've already seen this. If not, then I picked up this cute orange little jacket. Um, I love the color. I really, really like it. Um, the only thing I'm considering possibly changing the buttons to just gold buttons, but this is really, really cute. It does have six buttons here. You can button it all the way up here. And then it does come with a little tie waist. Well, I wouldn't call this a tie waist detail. It has this situation that you can um, tie it around your waist here. I'm trying to move this out the way. So yeah, you can do it like this at the waist, and this is pretty long. I got it in a one X, but yeah, it comes like this. So you can do that. More than likely, I just wouldn't even wear this unless maybe I was taking a picture. I just would leave this alone. But I thought this was really cute comfortable it is very lightweight again this is shein so this is not a heavy duty coat this is definitely something you'll throw on just if you need a jacket or if it's you know just a slight little breeze you can definitely throw this on and be cute so yeah love this one well, i picked up this fur leather fur leather faux fur jacket you guys um again i did haul this in my um jacket video but i don't know if it's posted before or after so Anyway, if you didn't catch that, I got this, and it just reminded me of like Cookie Lions. I thought it'd be cute and fabulous for the fall, um, but yeah, so it's cute, it's lightweight, it's just what I expected, something cute, you know, just to add a little flair, but um, it's not super heavy duty at all, and yeah, I like it. It does have these little latches here, so you can, you know, button it up that you can't see. This little latching there does latch all the way up to the neck. And yeah, let me know what y'all think about this. Is this a little bit too fabulous or would you rock it? Let me know in the comments. In addition to clothing, I did pick up two pair of boots from Shein. And this is the first pair. I thought these were super cute. I have been in love with this nice um, cognac or uh, caramel color. These are absolutely beautiful. I love a pointed toe and I love a stiletto heel. So I thought these were really cute. And of course, they're affordable. However... 
Um, these have absolutely no cushion here. And I know it's a single sole shoe, so it's not gonna give you, you know, the feel of a platform. I am a heel wearer, I understand that. However, these literally feel like I'm walking on my tippy toes on the bare hardwood floor. So <laughs> that's the first thing. But more than that, y'all, this heel has no security to it at all. Like, as a plus size girl, and I'm a heel wearer, I wear stiletto heels, I'm not new to that. However, these have no, like, this is real wall wall shaky shaky. This is very unsturdy. This is very unsure. And I don't do no wobbly heel. It's a no for me. <laughs> so um, this is my first time ordering shoes from Shein. So let me know in the comments, have y'all ordered any shoes from Shein? Do you guys like them? Um, I'm very particular when it comes to my shoes. Um, I, I, I just, mm -mm. they're cute but it's a no for me, especially because the heel is wobbly. I cannot do that. I also picked up these cute boots. I got these because I wanted more of a sock booty. I do have some black booties, but I don't have any that are fitted around the ankle. So I got it for that reason. But again, this one, now this one is not uncomfortable at the ball of the foot, but with this one, the heel is again, unstur um, not sturdy. And again, I do not like a wobble wobble shaky shaky heel i don't like that i need it to be sturdy i need it to be sure i need to be able to walk and know that my heel is not gonna crumble like that mm -mm. and that's what these shoes give me I, I i can't so they're cute they're affordable but i'd rather pay my extra money and get a nice sturdy heel <laughs> so yeah um i got these they're cute but it's a no for me all right beauties i'm curious to know if you guys have ordered from shein do you like them um i order from shein i'm not gonna say quite often but i do order here and there it's just one of those places to where i think the clothes are really cute they are super affordable but at the same time it's just been kind of hit or miss for me and this haul was definitely representative of that there are pieces that i love and there are pieces that i'm just like mm -mm, oh no <laughs> so comment down below and let me know you guys experience shopping with shein if you've tried them out also i'm interested to see if any of you guys have ordered their shoes and how you feel about them so definitely comment down below and let me know your experience and yeah thank y'all so much for watching and i'll see you next time bye